You've only seen half of me here, it's because we're showing you the toilet. Now this is the bathroom and this is an RV toilet. The RV toilet, it is a little bit different than the toilet you would have in your house. First, it's a little lower, but more important than that, it has a hole in the bottom that actually allows you to drain all the sewage back into the tank. Once you go into the toilet, you can actually simply press the pedal and it will flash, just like a toilet at home would. The most important part is that once you fill in the black tank, you need to empty the black tank. And after you empty the black tank, you need to flush twice or three times to put some liquid back into the tank and you need to drop chemicals inside of the tank to avoid any odor. Normally the chemicals are stored here and you can have chemicals in the bottle and you can read the direction and see how much you put or you can have in individual bags in which you just need to open the bag and toss the contents in. So to be able to put the chemicals you flush twice, you put the chemical and you flush a couple times again until the toilet bowl is clean. Now, let me show you the shower. This is the shower, as you can see. It's like a regular stand-up shower you would have in your house. The difference is that you do have a hose with a shower head connected to the control knobs. Normally, this is used also to stop and let the water go through out of the shower. Be careful, the water in the motorhome straight out of the hot water system will be hotter than normally what you would see in your house. Also the shower is where we normally store all the cleaning supplies while you're driving. So they're not moving around and if there's any problems with it, it's going to be contained inside of the shower tub. There is a vent above the bathroom, that vent is actually covered with a hood. So you can leave the door open. And also you can turn the fan either by pressing on the switch or by pressing on the switch on the wall. Keep in mind, leaving that open actually will affect losing cold because of heat coming in. And also it could eventually bring some small amounts of odor that are coming from the black tank vent that is actually right by that hood. But the fan is a great addition because it will actually move air out of the bathroom.